Good morning guys. Welcome back to our channel. If you are new here, hit the subscribe button. I'm gonna try and get my shit together this morning. Brian and I just got back from literally an unplanned, unexpected two week trip and my life feels like a mess. I feel like I look disgusting. I'm just not feeling my best. And I feel like sometimes this happens where you just like have days where you have to do some work and you're just like not feeling your best and you're still having to be in front of the camera or taking pictures. So honestly, thank you to Epic for sponsoring this video to help me with that. <laughs> but it is kind of early and I told myself, I was like, if I get up, and I get it done, then it'll keep me motivated and you never know. Manifest that these pictures will turn out good. We were traveling and let me tell you, my skin is hating me right now. Like I have the most like huge pimples, like just the ones that are like under the skin and that are just gross. I need to wash my hair, but I'm not going to because I'm just not. But I am gonna go ahead and put on some makeup because that's what's gonna make me feel good. I already know it. I need to cover these pimples. <laughs> Days like today where I don't wanna do like a full thing. I don't wanna do like a full B. I don't wanna feel like I'm wearing a ton of makeup. So I'm gonna do a super light coverage look. It does help right now that I have some, some eyelash extensions in. Not a lot, they're falling out. So I did go ahead and wash my face and I actually mixed my moisturizer with the Drunk Elephant Deep Bronzy Drops. I would show you what I used, but I can't find it. Like this is what my this is what my vanity looks like right now. That looks so bad. These. It doesn't even have the cap on it, but this is what I used. Not this exact one, because this one's right now. I have another one downstairs, but <laughs> you know, I could just throw it away. But yeah, this is what I used. Honestly, I love this for the days that I don't want to wear a lot of makeup because I can just mix it with my moisturizer. It gives me like a good tint. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with the Benefit Cakeless Concealer. I'm using the shade 2D02. I'm basically gonna put this everywhere that I have pimples, but also my under eyes because we didn't sleep for like two weeks. I really need to get lights for my vanity because I've been doing my makeup literally like just with whatever light the day throws me. Like right now it's kind of dark. I'm gonna turn the light. It's crazy when I put concealer on, like especially on my under eyes. My eyes are so dark that it just like brightens up my whole face. Anyways, I'm gonna try and stick to like cream products. This is my favorite blush ever, like my favorite cream blush. It's the Charlotte Tilbury Glowgasm, the blush like stick wand, literally. I just look like sun kissed like right after. It's so pretty. Now I'm gonna use the Glogasm highlighter. This is cute. Okay. See, I'm already starting to feel better. I'm using the Benefit brow pencil. This is the shade 3.5. So basically what I have to get done is I need to stay more on top of my Instagram pictures. What I try and do is I basically just try and have pictures lined up to post so that like I don't fall behind. That way it like keeps me on track with posting because I feel like I've like not neglected Instagram but like I feel like I've always wanted to post more. I'm trying to stay on top of my stuff and post more for you guys so if you're not following my Instagram already, go follow my Instagram. Oh, oh man. That's all for my makeup. I'm really gonna keep it so natural. I'm gonna have to go touch up my hair for my skin. Honestly, you guys could probably hear how loud the TV is right now. Ryan is watching football. I went ahead and put on this new romper that I got. I feel like this is definitely too simple for like an Instagram picture. So I'm thinking throwing like something like this over it because 
guys the weather is changing be a cute little fall vibe now i am so excited it's basically a white gray black flannel and it's cute to just throw over it ryan just got this so hopefully he doesn't get mad that i'm wearing it before he wears <laughs> do you have a rule where you can't wear their clothes until they wear it first well, hopefully he doesn't get mad. Oh, maybe I'll wear silver. I think I'll wear silver earrings. Hold on. I got these really cute, like, small silver hoops. So I think I'm going to put these on. Now we need shoes. Really cute gray. Different shades of gray Jordans. I always try and think of inspo before, like, going into taking pictures. These are the shoes. This is cute. Decent hair and makeup. I got a cute outfit and honestly Ryan takes like the best pictures of me. I feel like everybody has that like one person that just like really knows how to take pictures and like their angles and Ryan knows all my angles. Alright guys, change the plans. <laughs> so this outfit isn't going to work because of what I want to do. So I never like actually took really good pictures with my car. So I'm going to go for something a little bit more fancy. I'm going to wear this really cute two-piece set. It's like this sparkly black set. And I'm going to wear some heels with it. Super extra, but cute. I'll wait for the fall pics, okay? I have another idea for that, but I'm going to wait a little bit. I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the outfit. Um... It's so cute. Like, I actually love this. Oh, and it's going to go perfect with the car. So I'm going to throw on some black heels. Okay, so this is the outfit. I have my, my Moubatons on. I'm, I'm literally just in a 360. Can you hear? Benny's with me now. Oh, I wish I would have come with those. But I just want to go the reason why I changed is because Ryan gave me a better idea taking these pictures because like the other outfit just wasn't, wasn't it. Yeah, so normally I'm the brains of this operation. This is the beauty. <laughs> this is such a better idea, so. I have so many good ideas with her. Like, <laughs> just look at this beauty. She could be literally anything. Like. So I'm going to show you guys how I position like basically show you guys like posing and usually the angles that Ryan's getting and everything. I think everybody knows the struggle. Yeah. 5k likes if you know the struggle. Oh yeah. Alright guys, so I just changed into some comfy clothes and took my makeup off because I feel like that's like the best feeling. I put all of the photos on my phone and I just went through all of them and picked my favorites. So these are all the ones that I picked. These are the unedited pictures and there's things about them that I don't love so I'm actually going to be editing them a little bit. I don't ever edit my pictures like too too much but this is where I want to tell you guys about Epic because they're the editing app I've been using for a little bit now for my Instagram pictures and our YouTube thumbnails. It's completely free and they have so many different features on there. Okay, so this is what the app looks like and this is what it looks like when you pull it up. So as you guys can like see here is that some of the photos are like different lightings. So I do like having my pictures be very like similar. So I'm going to start with the first one. So on the tool section, you can cut things out you can this is where you can like crop so if i wanted to like zoom this in like 
that I could. You can patch certain things, which is like really cool. So you can like select a spot, move this around and basically patch it for like something else to like cover something up. And then they have the portrait. So, so I'm gonna go to skin because my skin isn't always clear and I'm gonna smooth my face a little bit. So this little button in the right hand corner, when you press it, it like shows you before and after so you can see like the difference. So I don't wanna do it too, too much. So I'm just gonna do it like 50. One thing I do like doing is I like having my eyes like super white in pictures. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this one a good bit. Oh, see, look, look at the difference. Also, another thing, they have retouch. So you can go to blemishes and literally, like, I could zoom in. And let's just do this little, like, you can, like, tap. Like, that literally just went away. Okay, now I want to show you guys some of the filters. So what I basically, ooh, that one's really pretty. Oh, wait, that one's so pretty. That makes everything look so vibrant and, like, I look... Wait. You can show how intense you want it. So if I didn't want it as vibrant, I could do it like 60. And it still looks so good. Wait, I actually love. I'm gonna come back to that. Okay, that that filter was called cheese. So let's go back to that one. See, they have some like different vibes for everything. Like there's are honestly really, really good filters. And I feel like there's something for every kind of picture. I do this a lot. Like I just sit here and go through everyone and whichever one catches my eye. But honestly, that first, that first one was so good. I do really like this filter, but I also really like to have like warmth to my photos. So I always like saturate it just barely, but like maybe like five saturation is probably my favorite editing adjustment but they have vibrance sharpen grain like they literally have everything on here and their effects are really cool like i'm not going to use any for this but like you see how like cr wait that actually looks crazy Wait, that's so cool. Why do I actually want to do that? The filters are a little too blue for me, but oh, I can, like, you know how, oh my god, wait, I actually really love this one. You know how, like, sometimes, like, blur photos look so much better? I could use this for, like, oh, period. Okay. Wait, why do I want to do this? I might do it. Oh, and look. You see how right there, like, the car was out of it, and I just erased it? Wait, wait, this looks so cool. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna save that. I just wanna show you some other features that they have. So you can add text, which is like really cool. I edit also our YouTube thumbnails on here too. And I'll pop up a picture of a thumbnail that I've used to like add text. And it's like super easy and they have so many different fonts and styles. And you can also add another picture to your picture. Okay, I wanna show you guys the before and after. This is the before and this is the after. <gasps> Wait, that's so cool. Okay, yeah, I think I'm gonna leave the picture like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and save it. I'm gonna go edit the rest of my pictures and then I'll come back and show you all of them. I just got done editing these. Oh my gosh. I'm just gonna go ahead and pop them up for you guys. I am shook because I was not like feeling my best and I didn't even like have that much makeup on and like I was really doubting these pictures but I feel like the editing just escalated these so much and honestly I feel like it looks so natural. Like, oh my god, I'm so shook. Wait, I actually love these. Like, Ryan! Okay, so... I want to show you my pictures because they're crazy, but then I want to show they look you. look good, right? Yeah, but I want to show you like what I did because you're going to be like so shook. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay, wait, wait. I need to show you what I did. Okay. But this is like what I did. <laughs> I didn't even recognize it. I know, it. that's what I'm saying. It's so like subtle, but like, yeah, those are like the, 
after looking at it, I didn't even realize that the sky looked like that. Like, I barely, I didn't even, like, edit myself. Like, I smoothed my face a little bit. But, like, that really just brought My picture's about to turn up. <laughs> right? That's what I'm saying. Yeah, I've never, like, Yo, tried this I didn't even this recognize effect. that. I know. But thank you so much to Epic for partnering with me in today's video because... I love you guys. Thank you for creating the most perfect app. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, like, you made stuff so easy for us. You guys can download the app from the link in our description. There'll be more information down below. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's video because sometimes, like, taking pictures and, like, filming videos and all that kind of stuff, sometimes you guys don't see how it all goes down and that it's honestly a process sometimes and sometimes we don't always feel the best in front of the camera. Give this video to 8,000 likes and make sure you go follow my Instagram and go look at these pictures. Y'all go run them up. <laughs> but we'll see you guys next video. Work, work out.